A couple of days ago, I installed this Amazon Basics Smart Switch uh, over here and have it, this one here, controlling my lights outside on my driveway and set a schedule so they come on about 30 minutes before sunset and then stay on to about 10, 10, 30, somewhere around there. So today I'm gonna to install it. Uh, it worked really well, so I'm gonna install it on some other outdoor light switches. So these are the, the, the two switches. They control two sets of outdoor lights. Uh, so right now, I can keep the light on in here, which will help. And I'm trying, just trying to figure out which uh, f uh, which breaker to turn off to get these. So I've always got my tester to make sure see if we got any power. So I'm gonna figure that off and then open this up and get going. Okay, so here is the, the box. Let's do a quick unboxing here. So I'm gonna do this with one hand, show you what's in here. Pretty much all the equipment that you need to uh, mount and uh, wire up. You have a wall plate, slide that out here. Wall plate, switch itself. That's just my tester turning off. Uh, instruction guide, this is really handy uh, because inside, um, inside your wall, your, your wires may not actually be uh, white, like the, have the right color for where they are. So you can take note of what you're taking off put a tag around it so you know you're gonna get the right wire to join and just a uh, Amazon Basics information. Thanks for your purchase piece of uh, material. So there we go. Okay, so here is where I'm gonna be installing uh, the switch. You, you'll notice it's quite bulky. It will go quite deep into the wall. So you really have to make sure that your wires are cleaned up. I'm gonna be replacing this one on the right-hand side here, but I'm actually going to be removing uh, both of them to make sure I have some uh, area to uh, work with, and then this one will just slide uh, back in. But you've got four four wires on here. You've got your uh, your ground, your neutral, your line, and your charge. Uh, so we'll see what's inside. And if it's the same colors, um, well, it's wired up this, we're gonna be great. If not, we're gonna use these uh, labels to uh, make sure we get a record of what the wires are being used for that are uh, within the wall. Okay, we're gonna take these off here. So I'm gonna take the other one off, just to open it up, give me a little bit more space, see what's happening on the inside. It's a pretty old house. We've got some switches that used to be three-way switches that are not three-way switches anymore. Um, so I just wanna make sure we're not inadvertently going to damage anything. So I've removed the old switches and I've attached a new one. Uh, one of them was actually a three-way switch, so basically we don't use the other one, so I've abandoned the other three-way switch. Uh, I'm going to plate it over and basically joined all the, the wires together. You can buy a three-way switch, uh, Amazon smart switch, but this is not one. So, uh, But that's fine because I'm going to be controlling it from my phone anyway. Uh, so there's a lot of wires. There's some ugly wiring in this house, but I have it all wired up. So my next step is to to bring these in and try and get these wires back in the box uh, as best as I can to have enough space for the uh, depth of this switch. Uh, so then once we get these mounted and then we move into the setup. These are my wife's hands holding the uh, switch in place. Okay, so we're on. So you don't want to put the face plate on before you finish setting up the app because this little QR code Obviously, if you put the faceplate on, you're going to cover it up. And you need that to set up a switch in the app. So when you open the Alexa app on your phone, it's going to automatically recognize you have a switch ready for setup. So I'm going to tap continue. Uh, and then I'm going to allow it to use my camera and my Bluetooth to connect with it. And then I'm going to scan the, the QR code that's on the switch right there. And, um, and then pretty much there's not a lot to be 
for me to do, except watch, watch my phone and see it go through the sequence of connecting to the device and then um, relaying the wi Wi-Fi information to the device and then it asks me to add the device to a group. So I have a group on my uh, Alexa account already called outside where I have uh, my outside lights attached to. Um, so that's where I'm gonna join the switch and it's gonna call it the new name switch found, the controller, say, so it's gonna be some instructions. So it's called this switch, my third switch because I have not given the first two any imaginative names. Uh, so it's done, my, I'm gonna put it on the outside group, add to group, third switch attached, uh, sorry, third switch added to outside. Uh, and I have a routine set for that outside. Uh, and it's giving me some instructions, it's ready for use. So there we go, we are good to go. And now if I go into switches up here, you can see I have my first one I had already and the second and third were the ones that we did today. I did one before I did the recording. So this third one is the final one and I can power them all on and off as a group. Uh, I'm looking at my window now and it's working just great. So we have it working. So now I can put the face plate on. I'm just finishing that up uh, and we're good to go. I've turned them on manually on the switches and the lights are coming on outside. I turned it on and off with the uh, Alexa app and it's working great. So pretty happy with this. Like it's pretty straightforward install. As soon as, as long as you figure out and record the wires, they're going from your old plug, uh, old switch. So you use the same ones and locations on your new, on the new Alexa switch. Um, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up, hit subscribe. And yeah, you'll see a bunch of other improvements we're doing. Uh, to this house. We live in an old house. It was built in 1955. Actually, I did this light this morning. Uh, it was built in 1955. Uh, there's a lot to improve. So our channel is our story of our journey uh, in updating uh, this old country house. We live on three acres of land in the country. Uh, so lots to show and uh, tell you. Uh, thanks for watching.